Squid Game. It has gone absolutely viral all over Netflix, TikTok, YouTube. Everybody has heard about it. But to be honest, I didn't know about it until Mr. Cat told me. Apparently he was binge watching it all last week. But now I really see the hype. And that show is crazy. If you don't know what it is, it's pretty much a bunch of people who really need money, who get persuaded to play in these different types of games for cash. Except if they lose, the consequences are uh not so good, if you know what I mean. So today we're gonna be reacting to different viral TikTok trends about Squid Game. Smash like if you love Squid Game. Or smash like if you love squids. Oops, Mr. Cat. Nobody asked you. The first game these people play is a red light, green light game. And there's a scary giant doll singing this song. And you go when it's green light and you stop when it's red light. Pretty simple, no? And the goal of the game is to get past the red line. But uh, one small detail. If you go on the red light instead of stopping, that crazy doll got some devil eyes on you. And then you get oofed. I wish I was joking. If she catches you with her head turned around, then you's in big trouble. Okay, this is another one of their games where they gotta break shapes out of a honeycomb cookie. They gotta either use a little pin to carve out the shape or flick it off with their tongue. And if the shape cracks, yeah, you probably guess what's gonna happen to you. You going sleepy time bye-bye. Forever. At least you went out eating a cookie dough. Priorities. So this guy was so stretched getting out of his shape, but he did it perfectly. He got that triangle. He shows the evil guy because these guys are like the evil guys that are in charge of all the poor people and then this girl is so nervous and look she broke her shape oh that ain't no circle no more miss i think you made it into a pac-man head but look how nervous she is after she found out that she broke the circle because you know what's gonna happen to her now she gonna be broken oh you see what they're doing those men ain't nice wait what is this Oh, wait a sec. This is the Squid Game experience at Netflix headquarters. Oh, this is cool. Oh, man. I want to go here so bad. Oh, there's the evil doll. Mm, she's just waiting there, sitting, lurking, waiting to just poop some poor, poor people. Because, you know, they need the cash. This is really fun. I'm not going to lie. Honestly, all of Squid Game kind of looks fun. Minus the oofing part. The games and cookie eating sounds good, though. And look at those people in the back with the red jumpsuits but you know family there's been a big debate on if those jumpsuits are red or hot pink and upon further inspection do we see a similarity mm, i'd probably say pink dang it squid game why you gotta make my favorite color an evil color not cool pov you just got out of the bathroom and see a giant animatronic doll yeah i would freeze too i know i already went to the bathroom before seeing this but somehow i already peed my pants. Is she creepy? Family, could you imagine having this done to you in real life? Like, seriously, I want you to take a second right now and just think about how scared you would actually be. In Squid Game, there are six different games. There's the red light, green light game, the shape honeycomb game, tug of war, the marbles game, the glass game, and then the Squid Game. To be honest, if I'm being honest, I think I'd be out in first round. That red light, green light game ain't made for shaky people like me. I'd be cruising, going along, and then Red light, oh, yeah. I wouldn't be able to stay still. The only time I could actually stay still is when I need intense precision when I'm popping somebody else's pimple. But that's for another day. Me, if I played in Squid Game. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that so me? You just be going along and then red light. Oh, strike a pose. That dude's striking a pose like he's taking some awkward driver's license pic. Smile for the camera. But you do you, boy. If that is your Vogue pose, then all the power to you. Oh, no. They probably oofed him just because his face looked funny. I mean, I would have. Okay, I think this one is so cool. This is the behind the scenes of how Squid Game was actually made and filmed. Oh, look at all that space. All those people. That giant doll. Why is it so big? Kind of unnecessary if you ask me. Okay, here's all of the cast. Oh, in their green jumpsuits and the cookie. Oh, and there's the actual warehouse where they set up all the different scenes. Oh! Oh my gosh, why is this spooky? Even though I know it's just a show, it's still kind of making me feel a certain way. I don't know, family. Like, it's not real, but it is real, you know? My feelings are real. And they're scared. Mr. Cat, what would you do if you were on Squid Game? You think you would survive? 
All right, kinda cocky. You about the size of that doll's pinky toe. <laughs> Mr. Kai, you're a bear. You don't need that much money. <laughs> Dude, you can't even drive. Oh. When you're in the squid game, but so is your ex? Oh. <laughs> oh. I guess somebody's still bitter. I mean, hey, I guess it's one less person to compete against for all that cash, right? Every man for himself? Okay, this is just straight up cursed. It's that doll doing a little jiggly dance to her own twisted song. There's people oofing all around her and all she cares about is to do the wiggles. That's dark. She's dressed like she's about to go to a birthday party at five, but little did we know that she's going to the purge at seven. The squid game purge. I don't know which one's worse. Okay, so this is the honeycomb cookie that you gotta break the shape off of in the game. So this guy got a circle, so he's trying to get all the pieces around it off. So all he's left with is the circle. And it looks like he did it. Challenge complete. I guess this guy made his own squid game cookie. And oh, there's a circle. Okay, so he... No! And that's exactly what you don't want to happen. Oh, wait a sec. His circle wasn't even ruined. I guess he passed too. This person also made their own, but I don't think they made it that right because it looks too puffy and the whole of the circle is way too big. Yeah, obviously you cut it out perfectly, girl. You practically cheated. You cut a shape out of a piece of bread and called it a cookie. Ain't no challenge in that, except not eating it before you cut it. Cause let's be real, that's the hardest part. Y'all really think they're feeding these people in the squid game? Uh, nuh uh. They gotta fight for their lives from the evil people. And also from their bellies, cause they starving. If me and my sister play in the squid games. Oh no, he didn't. Oh no, he did not just push over his sister. Dude, I get you're not trying to oof yourself, but that's too savage for me. Don't you want to work together with her? Don't you want someone you can trust? But he won a couple hundred bucks from Squid Game and now he's a totally different person. <laughs> Disrespect. POV, you made it into the second game of Squid Game. Oh. <laughs> Dude, that's true. The people in the game can barely get circles, triangles, and umbrellas. There is no way he's getting that thing. That thing has more loops and turns than my headphones do when they get tangled. Kiss that cookie and your life goodbye, my friend. Oh. When you don't understand Korean. <gasps> oh, no, no, no. Buddy, of course you want to eat the cookie. Everybody wants to eat the cookie. What do you want to eat the cookie more than you want your life? So don't eat the cookie, bro. Don't you see literally hundreds of people around you fall into the ground? I don't care that you don't know Korean. Pay attention to the signs. It ain't that hard. Okay, so this is all of them doing the cookie cutter honeycomb game. They're trying to lick the shapes out or some of them use the pin, but oh, there's the pin. That's the grandpa. For some reason, the grandpa is all happy the whole time in the game. Everybody else is literally miserable, but he's all smiley and having a good time. Kind of suspicious. Oh, and he got the umbrella. Oh my gosh. He's so happy he's about to cry. Everybody, the old man. <laughs> Why is that so accurate? Everybody's like, oh, oh, please no, please no. Oh, oh. Old man's like, how's your day going? Oh, save it, old man. Wipe that smile off your face before I wipe it off for you. And you ain't gonna like my way. Game begin. <gasps> Don't move, bro. Don't move. Oh, whoa, that went from zero to 100 real quick. He's a lot cuter than the doll in the game. Or should I say prettier? I don't know, but either way, I like it. That is until he's probably gonna oof me too, isn't he? Yeah, okay, never mind. If Mr. Beast was in the squid game. There is over $100,000 inside <laughs> of this bank vault. <laughs> and whichever one of these guys touches the vault first gets what's inside. Now we go. Uh, Mr. Beast. You can't be promoting stuff like this. I know you like to give away money and stuff, bro, but not like that. Not good for your image. When you join the squid game because you have student loans, but you also have an essay due at 11.59. <laughs> I 
I relate to that one. Being a student ain't no joke. It practically feels like life or death every day. Now this dude gotta worry about both. I feel for you, buddy. Good news is if he accidentally moves, maybe he can use his laptop as a shield. They say those MacBooks can handle anything. Let's put him to the test. Oh no, he got the circle. Can he do it? He did it. Oh, he survived. Oh, no. When you try and cheat, but it doesn't work out the way you wanted it to. I'm surprised Buddy even gave him back the cookie to try again. If you cheat in school, you don't get a second chance. They just gonna rip up your test and tell you to get out. So I guess in Squid Game's terms, that's a uh, oofin' ya. Like, get out forever. You know what I mean? But anyways, family, that is all of the Squid Game TikToks that I have for you today. If you liked today's video, don't forget to smash that like button. And if you want to join our amazing family, all you gotta do is hit that subscribe button, turn on all post notifications, and then you won't miss any of our videos. Also, don't forget to go follow me on my Instagram right down here. I love you all so much. And I'll see you all in the next video.